Good morning, everyone. Thanks for joining us for 16 Morning News. Now, as you look at those current temperatures, honestly, we're not doing all that bad. Got a lot of this north wind starting to filter in. And this will be something we'll be seeing all day long. Northwesterly wind. So right now it's still a little bit northeasterly, but once we start getting that more free flowing air moving in, it'll shift out of the northwest. So we'll be seeing some cooler air filtering in for off, off of the lake. Current lake temperatures out toward the middle of the lake are still sitting in those upper 60s. Meanwhile, toward the coast, we're in those low 70s. So we will be seeing that nice cool air filtering in. It will help us stay cool for our day today. We're looking at nice morning temperatures in the 60s. We'll be clearing as we get into the afternoon and evening expecting not really any rain chances today. Thus, the only day we can really say that because as we head into Friday, we're going to sit around 30% chance for some more of those thunderstorms. Again, there's a very limited severe threat with some of these storms, but we're not expecting really much anything to come out of them. It really is very dependent on the day of forecast. So we're probably going to be talking more about that tomorrow. And as we get into our Saturday, probably the best rain chances over the next several days, but then we're just gonna be hanging around with the 20% for several days now, Sunday, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, next week, man, it's looking like quite a bit of these tiny little rain chances, but you know, we could, I guess we could still use the rain, Trisha. We are going to be looking at that drought monitor coming out later on this afternoon, so we'll give you more details about that as we get closer to that time frame. All right. Thank you, Martin. 451 now, a 97 year old Massachusetts woman decided.